In my last video, I showed that in eInk Pro, you can use page turning buttons to turn pages instead of scrolling. However, most third party apps don't support that. For example, I am using Inno Reader, a very nice RSS reader, and uh, it works really nice on Node Air. Scrolling is not bad, that, but if you want to turn pages, you can use the built in navigation bar. Yes, the Navigation Ball app is a first-party app from Onyx Books, and it will work as overlay over the app interface. So it's quite versatile. You can customize. There are a lot of buttons on it. You can decide which button will be the so-called resident button, so they will always stay on the screen. So in that way, you can set the scroll up button and scroll down button always on the screen, and will work in all apps. So right now I'm trying to use Firefox on Android. So I'm trying to open the New York Times. You can see the overlay button on the side is kind of transparent now. So it's a little bit slow, but it works. So now I'll try to compare this on-screen scroll up, scroll down buttons with the built-in page up, page down button in eInk Pro. So the built-in buttons are much more responsive in my use. and. Uh, this scroll down button, it works a little bit laggy. By the way, the navigation ball has so much hidden functionalities in this app, you can fully customize it. And it is probably one of the most underrated, in terms of functionality, app on this uh, Onyx Book devices. So uh, feel free to explore how to customize it uh, to your own need. Thank you for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.